Well, an Uber driver in Florida says he was scratched, strangled, and bitten by his passenger. It happened last weekend when a woman asked him to get her mother home safely. News Nation's Christine McClarty spoke to the victim, who says he's now traumatized by what happened. I'm just your Uber driver. I'm just your Uber driver. Michael Hassey says he thought he was going to die. It was hands down the most traumatizing thing that's ever happened to me. Hassey was working as an Uber driver when his passenger turned on him. Police quickly arrested the passenger, 55-year-old Michelle Stillwell. The police report says Stillwell could have been drunk. My kid. My daughter. Hassey says Stillwell's daughter called the Uber for her mom. He says she slept most of the ride before violently waking up blocks from her home. Hassey wants to know why. We went to Stillwell's home in unincorporated St. Pete on Tuesday looking for answers. With no answer, we went back Wednesday. This man answered in tears, saying he's Rob, Michelle's husband. Rob claims his wife doesn't remember anything for three to four hours until waking up in the hospital. He says she's not doing well, and neither is he. I'm second chance, so we have a lot going on. <laughs> The Pinellas County Sheriff's Office has advice for all rideshare drivers. You want to get that car stopped and get, a, get away from the attackers as quickly as possible. But Hassey says he's disappointed in Uber. He feels the company hasn't done enough since the attack. Think twice before you decide to go drive for Uber because it might not be worth it. I'm not going to touch you. Eight on your side reached out to Uber on Hassey's behalf asking, what is Uber doing to protect drivers? And what is Uber doing for this specific driver? Please stop. I have done nothing. I have done nothing to deserve this. Christine McClarty, News Nation.